When soldiers come home, you can always count on a crowd, and this homecoming didn't disappoint. Cheryl Colbus is waiting for her daughter, Caitlin. Anxious. I'm, I don't even know what I am. I'm about to lose it, but I just want her home. But this day, an unwelcome visitor was hovering just overhead. Just a little rain. But in a matter of minutes, it went from a sprinkle to a downpour. Even so, spouses like Robin Ross were determined to stick it out. Exciting, and I'm going to stay out here until I see him land. The rain briefly delayed the landing, forcing some families to admit defeat and run for cover, but not Robin Ross. This is her running back to the airfield. She had some extra motivation. Our daughter was born three days ago, so he hasn't met her yet. The rain had them running from children to adults to members of the 101st Airborne some of whom haven't seen this kind of rain since they left Fort Campbell this time a year ago. Eventually, the weather blended into the background, giving way to the pomp and circumstance you expect when the screaming eagles welcome home some of their own. And with that, the real homecomings began. Hugs and kisses all around, and specialist William Ross meeting his baby girl for the very first time. I was very excited about meeting my daughter for the first time and also being with my wife.